hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i want to share with you what i bought in edmonton when we went there after vacation um, we did not spend the whole the night we just went for a few hours did some shopping and came home the same day so before i get into that i want to share my jacket with you guys i this is the first time I'm actually wearing this jacket and I've had it for a long time and I paid $20 for this jacket. So originally it was $59.99, then it was marked down to $32.99 and then it went down to $20. So that was a pretty good deal and I got it at Sears. A while ago the tag was still on because I never wore it so I had to take the tag off and it's the Jessica brand so yeah and it's a fall a fall uh, a fall jacket so it says on the top there FA which mean and it's an old stock because FA1 is fall 2001 so it's pretty old but I love it and it's a really nice color and yeah so I just wanted to share it out first with you guys and um, I'm gonna start showing you what I got so I picked up a, a few things uh, first I visited my um, liquidation store where we always go at Christmas time to get stocking stuffers and um, I picked up a few things there because they have the stuff they sell really cheap so and I have their flyer but I'm not gonna be using it because we are not there now so so I want to show you I got some Christmas gift bags and we don't really need these now but you never know maybe you might have to give somebody a gift you can just put it in a gift bag with some tissue paper and put a couple staples on the top and you're good to go instead of finding a box and wrapping because sometimes the things don't come in boxes so you have to put it in a box and then wrap it i find gift bags are much easier however when you wrap a present it looks way nicer because you can really dress it up with ribbons and bows and all these good stuff but gift bags are easy i usually do that if i'm gonna give a friend a gift i just put it when i was working and i used to have to take uh gifts for people i would just put it in a gift bag and that's it easy peasy so i got some nice patterns i got this one and then i've got this one here which is really cute and then i've got this one and i've got this one super cute and they're a nice size as well so you can use it for a lot of things and then I picked up a couple of ribbons as well, the, like you can wrap it around the, your presents if you do have to wrap them. So this, these were a dollar each. You see that? And it's got, it's red with like some gold stars on them. And then this one is a dollar as well. And this one is red too with stars and some bells on there. And then this one is just a gold one. So you can wrap it around your present, you know what I mean? So that's those ones. Um, let me see if I still have the, the uh, receipt. So I can see how much I paid for those bags. I guess I don't. I think I paid with my credit card. I must have put it with my statement or something. Yeah, so probably not even a dollar. 
Okay, I don't seem to have the receipt, so I'll just show you what else I got from the same store. I got these uh, wipes. Uh, it's aloe and chamomile. And it says baby wipes, and there's uh, 80 in here for $2. And you always need these wipes, so I just figured, well, they're cheap, I'll pick some up. Because I bought a set from... Uh, well.ca and it's in my fiance's vehicle so we open them and put it in a ziploc bag so i just want some more for home because in case i take the dog out and he has dirty paws then i can bring him home and just wipe them you know what i mean and then i got this this was the only one they had, so I don't know if they had other designs as well, but this one was super cute, and it's got a mirror on the top, and it's got, it, it looks like a little vanity is what I'm thinking, and it's got two drawers. You can store your little jewelry in there like your little earrings or your necklaces or whatever and that's the back and this one was $12 $12 for this I find this super cute and very nice would look good in a girl's bedroom so it can be used buy it for a, your daughter or your sister or whoever you know, it's pretty girly and I like it. A pretty cute eye day for Christmas. So yeah, I got that one. And that was it for that store. And um, I went to Bed Bath & Beyond as well. So I've got some things in here. And also I did some shopping for my fiance at Sears but I wouldn't show you guys what this is because this is part of his Christmas presents yes I've started my Christmas shopping since August and I'm doing most of it online so so I went to Bed Bath & Beyond and I picked up two of these spray bottles I've been looking for small ones like these for a while and because I have one but it's pretty big I think I've got a green one as well these are good for like my I'm gonna start doing uh, essential oils like mixing them and using them for different things around the house so I figured these will be small and nice because you usually you don't need a lot of it uh, it's some of them are good for cleaning and stuff like that so I'm just gonna label them so I know what's inside and what I use it for and yeah these are a good size they have lots in stock if I need more I can always grab them so I got those and then I got this for my dog it's a handy drink dog drinker provides clean water to keep your dog hydrated snap bottle snap bottle into water pan and squeeze so it's just uh i don't know how to open this up it's uh like for when you're going for a walk it this bottom part here oh cup folds over and oh here it is so you fill this up and then you squeeze it somehow and it pours or drains into there and then you can give him a drink which is pretty nice we had one before and it got broken so I figured I would buy another one so this is $6.99 that's which is not a bad price I mean you know and, and then you've got this you can hook it on to something too so that you're not just carrying it in your hand all the time yeah and then I got these ones these are uh what do you call these scented sachets like you put them in your vanity drawers or um or your closet and um 
and it smells really good. I've had a couple of these before and they really last a long time. They smell good. I put these this bag in one of the bedrooms and you wouldn't believe every time I go in there, I smell it. It's super nice. It smells good. And they also have a, a website, freshscents.com. So you're getting three inside for $6.99. And this one is in... Oh, what does it say? Live your passion. Live your passion, I guess this one is called. And then I've got, I got three sets of these ones. They're all different. This one is called Summer Romance. So they're showing you, you can put them where you can use them. They smell really good. Um, You've got bathrooms, your vacuum bags, really. Hmm, I never knew about that. Trash cans, closets, in your car, like under the seats, or gift baskets. You probably can do that if you're give, making up a gift basket. It's a good idea for that. So that's that set. And then this set here is, is called... What is this one called? Ah, it's called, I don't know, but it smells good. So I bought it. It's always three in a pack. So it's pretty nice. They're made in the USA and they were getting low on them. They have lots of different ones to choose from. So, but they were getting low on them. So I'm going to put them in our maybe in the closet first see how they work and stuff like that so i'm just gonna go charge up this camera for a little bit and so that it doesn't shut off okay guys so stay tuned hey guys so i put it to charge a little bit so i hope uh i can <laughs> get this done I'm gonna try and see how quick I can do this so I visited Sephora when I was in the mall and picked up a couple things so the first thing I got was the Tarte Tarte yes uh, it's two lipsticks in there and um, they're pretty small like travel sizes they usually sell a lot of these uh little gift ideas when you go into the store it's just right next to the till as you're in the lineup they have like a shelf with a lot of different things and these are pretty cute for like stocking stuffers and stuff like that i forget what i paid for this and i got this um black magic set of two makeup remover cloths uh i've been reading the reviews on this online and i've seen people were saying that they're good to use so i decided to get them they're good for traveling as well so um it says here machine washable cloths that remove makeup mascara oils and pollutants with just water no cleaner necessary perfect to stop smudging towels with makeup as you travel with this reusable travel friendly porch it should be pouch perfect to fit in your purse yeah so and then you can wash and reuse them. You don't have to throw them out like if you use wipes and that kind of stuff. You just wash with regular detergent and save for all wash cycles. And they say do not use fabric softener or bleach and air dry. So once you wash it and it spins out dry, you just hang it someplace like I've got my drying racks. So that's all you need for this so yeah i'm gonna try these out too and see how they work and then i got a couple things at the dollar store it's called a dollar tree and um i thought this was from walmart i think it was so what i got from our dollar tree was these ones 
little mini candles. I know my fiance doesn't like these, but I actually bought it to use like in my Instagram videos and stuff like that. Or if I'm gonna insert like a little clip when I'm doing my videos, I can just light it up for that and then put it out right away as soon as I'm done. Or I'm gonna put them in our closet to, to leave a scent because I know somebody who does that, like she has uh, the apple cinnamon fragrance one and it's in her closet and when you open it up, it smells good. You don't have to light it. So this one smells really nice and this one is the pear, pear uh, scented one and it's pretty nice. Smells good and then I've got the black cherry one which is really a nice fragrance. I really like this one. And then I've got this one is different. It's got the wooden uh, top. This one is Merlot and this smells really nice as well. So I like the shape. They had other fragrances in this one, but I like this one better. So that's this one. And then I got this tray. that I can put on my vanity and it's just a little silver like aluminum type one you can put it on your vanity and put stuff inside your jewelry or whatever you want to put in there and I've got the receipt in here so those candle ones were 125 each and the, the tray was 125 so really good uh, deal there on those so I ended up spending five dollars on this stuff. The underwear, like I said, was from another store. I don't remember what I paid for them. Yeah, so I figured I'd come and show you guys that before this camera shuts off again. I wanted to make this quick. So yes, guys, so that was my haul and I wanted to show you guys that because we're going to be going to Edmonton soon because I have an appointment speaking of which I need to make another appointment as well because as I'm there I may as well make another appointment get everything done um, so we're just gonna do our Christmas shopping as we're there get it done early um, a lot of the stuff might not be out as yet but what we're buying is just whatever is in the store we don't have to wait for Christmas or we don't have to wait for the stock to come in. Uh, most of the stuff that I'm buying for him is going to be online because I've already picked up a few things in stores already that I needed. So I'm just going to order the rest of it online. Um, but yeah, we will be shopping and it's nice and early, quiet, no long lineups, no uh, people standing in your way and crowded malls and stuff like that and plus you'll find parking very easy during the week because that's when we're going to be there so and my fiance doesn't really like to wait till december because who knows what the weather is going to be like like it's nice all the snow is melted now here but that time the roads might be bad, it might be really cold and we almost got into an accident coming home one time from doing Christmas shopping and it gets dark early as well so you can see the deer and we have a lot of deer on the road here too. So he prefers to get it done early and he's going to be off with me for a few weeks in December so he's gonna be off for Christmas and New Year's which is good he tries to take Christmas off every year now because he doesn't like me to be alone out here in Edmonton it was different lots of times he would come home after Christmas and I would have to spend Christmas alone but I knew he was coming home so it didn't really bother me I would be working the only day I didn't work was Christmas Day because I work retail and the stores are always open 
every day except for Christmas Day. So, so yeah, so he's going to be home at least if our shopping is done. We can wrap our presents early when I decorate. Just put them under the tree. I love to do that. The 1st of December, I'm going to be able to decorate. I usually, I like to decorate before we go to Edmonton. So when we come home, you can see the house decorated, but we're going earlier this time. So that's fine. It'll get done. Yeah, so, and then we've got the whole of December to go other places if we need to. Like if we've got a couple more presents to pick up, we can go to another town, which is like two and a half hours from here. So no rush. And we can visit some of the other smaller stores. So yeah, that's my plan. I'm going to be going there, buying Christmas presents, some stuff for myself as well. So... You have to stay tuned for that, okay guys? Well, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you again soon, okay guys? Take care now. Bye-bye.